made it to the beach. We're at St. Pete and the water is so blue today. It is so nice out. I just got here and put on my sunscreen and I'm already ready to go for an ocean dunk. I'm so excited. It's gonna be so fun. And I brought my goggles and my snorkel to try to find some pretty shells. But we're gonna head, we're gonna do an ocean dunk and tan and just hang out at the beach before we check okay. into our Airbnb later today. <laughs> We're doing a little girls trip and I told them they have to dunk with me. <laughs> Go. Try to dive. Go. I'm gonna put the goggles on for my dunk. Okay, I got my goggles on. Let's go for a dunk. Three, two, one. That was so fun. Okay, you wanna do a dunk? Can we do yeah. a dive? Are you, are you Three, two, one. The water's People so warm I'm here so too. It's a wave coming. With a shark attached. <laughs> <laughs> no shark. The water is super clear but a little bit cloudy, so I can't really see much with my goggles, but I'm trying. Three, two, one. Time to go put my phone up and play mermaids. We're just hanging out on the beach. I am going to reapply my sunscreen now, but we saw the cutest set of dolphins. It was so cool. I love seeing them. I tried to get in the water when they were like right in front of us, but they moved literally so fast. I just bought this sunscreen at the gas station and it's broken and I have to squirt it out at the top where there's like a hole in it. So that's very inconvenient. Also, I did not show you guys my nails I got done for Florida. They are starfish. I think they're so cute. But we're gonna have lots of beach days and I definitely do not wanna be sunburned, so I definitely have to make sure I am reapplying all of my sunscreen. Oh, I just rubbed so much sand all over my leg. That was awful. What time is it? We were swimming for so long and the clouds got so dark. I think it's gonna storm. It's like, <laughs> look at the clouds. They got so dark. It is gonna rain. So, we're packing up. We made it to our Airbnb. all just finished getting ready after our beach day we went to the grocery store and then came home and showered and got dressed I'm wearing this romper that I thrifted and I have no idea where it is from but I think it is so cute I love the little ruffle details and then I'm wearing this ring don't know where it's from sorry and then this seashell necklace that i'm wearing and these gold hoops from targets but we're getting ready to go out for drinks and just explore the town <laughs> and take some pictures of course i already drank like almost all of it but we came to daiquiri deck for our first stop of the night <laughs> amy right yours on a scale of one to ten Six. <laughs> really? <laughs> what do you rate yours? Seven. <laughs> it's so cute in here. It's like an indoor rooftop in Sarasota. Early night for us. We got so tired after the daiquiri deck. But... <laughs> Now we're trying to compromise on our one bed sleeping situation. Open. I can't even get a bed. <laughs> yeah, I can't 
<laughs> Amy's sleeping down there and me and Megan up here in our bed. ready for the day for our beach day we're going to get some coffee and then some breakfast I'm so excited and then we're gonna have our beach day it's gonna be so much fun I got an ice vanilla latte with oat milk and it is really good we're eating at this place called another broken egg for breakfast and I got pancakes and bacon it looks so yummy I'm so excited to eat it that is really good. We made it to the beach. It's going to be such a fun day. beach day a little bit early it's 2 p.m. and I got another ice latte because I love trying coffee shops on vacation that's like my favorite thing finding a good coffee shop and this one I actually got something new I got a white mocha with coconut because she said coconut was her favorite and I've never had coconut in a latte so I tried it and it's very good it's like a really subtle flavor but I love it and then my friend got an ice latte Megan but she spiked it with Bailey's or Klua um, yeah, but she loves hers too. I took the cutest pictures at the beach today. I'm gonna post them on Instagram, but the water was so pretty. I took these pictures with my tripod. Back at the Airbnb, I showered and put on this tube top dress. Now I'm gonna do my makeup to get ready to go to dinner and then try to go to a beach sunset later which will be super fun i surprisingly have not got super sunburned i feel like normally on beach trips being out in the sun i get so sunburned but i have been doing really good on my sunscreen so i think that is why i'm gonna do my makeup and then i'll show you my finished look okay we're getting in the car to go to dinner but this is my outfit of the night I love this dress so much. I think it's going to be so cute taking sunset photos. Now to go to dinner. Good morning. It is the next day and I am currently waiting at a coffee shop for my coffee. I got these little buzzers because I ordered a side of bacon too. It's this cute little cafe in Sarasota. But we got a late start to our day. It's already 12 p.m. and we're heading to Tampa, St. Petersburg area for the day and I'm so excited. We're gonna do so much exploring and going to cute restaurants and spots. It's gonna be so much fun. We're gonna head straight to Bar Taco in Tampa. My friend recommended it to me and it looks so good so I'm really excited about that. I'm just standing at the coffee shop waiting for my friend's order. Before we go, I got my coffee and a side of bacon, so I'm just eating this really quick before we drive. We're at our lunch spot and it is so cute. <laughs> I got some shrimp tacos, we all got some tacos, and we're sitting outside in the Hyde Park Village. It is adorable. Did a little outfit change. Now we're out for cocktails at this cute rooftop. And it is so cute up here. All the little details, like the chairs, so stunning. Is that taste refreshing? Really. So refreshing. 
<laughs> We're in downtown St. Pete and so far I love it. I think it is so beautiful down here. The sun is shining and the sun is about to set so hopefully we will have a pretty view. I got a mocktail. It is like this guava passion fruit and it is so cute. Amy is taking her photo shoot with her vodka lemonade. <laughs> in Florida. It's in this little cove area and I think it is so stunning. The water is looking crystal clear and look at my starfish nails matching the ocean. Okay, ready to go for a dunk. Three, two, one. It has been so fun swimming in Florida. I am definitely moving here one day because I could get used to this. Also, I cut my foot so bad a little bit ago on the beach, and I'm not sure if I'm attracting sharks. I won't show you my foot all the way, but that is where it's just bleeding. And not gonna lie, it kinda hurts. Another dunk. Now I'm gonna go get my goggles and play mermaids with my friends. We had a fun beach day, went to coffee shop, and got some lunch, and now it is time for dinner. I just got ready, I'm wearing this cute little flower dress and we're going to a cute waterfront dinner i'm so excited and then maybe be able to watch the sunset and just enjoy our last full night here but it's been such a fun day it was so pretty at the little cove spot where we went swimming and now we get to go eat a yummy dinner Good morning we woke up with the sun today and it did not disappoint we're up early to watch the sunrise and go get breakfast and coffee before I take my friends to the airport I take them to the airport like a way before I do I'm gonna drop them off at like 9 and then I don't go back to the airport till 2 p.m. so stunning there is a dolphin in the water oh my goodness wait we have to wait for it to come up again <gasps> right there I honestly wasn't even expecting a good sunrise since I know the sun doesn't rise on the west coast, but this did not disappoint. The water here is seriously so pretty and the fact that we got to see a dolphin and a pretty sunrise, so worth it. Now there's multiple dolphins out. I love it. Ending off the sunrise with finding some pretty shells. I am obsessed with finding shells in Florida. Like, why are they all literally stunning? Such a perfect way to start the morning. I just got to the beach after dropping my friends off. It is only 10 a.m. and it is already so hot. I'm about to go for an ocean dunk, but I just put my sunscreen on, so I'm trying to let it sit. But I got my beach snack, and I don't have my whole beach bag because I packed it away in my suitcase, so I just kind of have my purse, my water, and I did get my beach towel out, so I am sitting on that. But the water looks divine. I'm so excited to jump in after I finish letting this soak, but I'm wearing this cute purple bikini from Target. And I'm so sad that I have to leave here today, but my plan is to stay at the beach for like two hours and then head to this coffee shop that I really wanna try. <laughs> Even though I went to get coffee this morning, but you can never go wrong with having two, especially because the coffee shop that I'm gonna go to in St. Pete is literally so pretty. It looks so colorful in the pictures and it looks so good. So yeah, that is kind of my day. I'm probably gonna take some pics of myself with my tripod, go for an ocean dunk, and kind of just lay here tan, but mostly probably be in the water. I love it here. St. Pete is definitely my favorite area so far. Using my GoPro for the first time in Florida on my last day. Don't know why it took me so long to pull it out, but we're gonna go swimming. I'm gonna take you underwater and see if we can see anything. Hopefully it's not cloudy and 
it'll be clear for us to go do a little snorkeling, maybe find some shells. Got my goggles on, let's go for a dunk first. Three, two, one. We're gonna go for a swim. Okay, I genuinely have no idea if you guys can see underwater with a GoPro because I'm not able to look at the footage until I transfer it to my phone. But for me, looking through my goggles, it is very, very cloudy. Like the water is clear, but it's very cloudy underneath. Probably from all the sand getting kicked up so I'm not too sure if the GoPro footage is gonna look good and if you'll be able to see. Either way it's still fun to swim and do some dunks. fun and so refreshing I literally had the best beach day the water was so extremely blue and as the Sun just kept coming out it just kept getting prettier and prettier but I had to wrap it up so I could go to this coffee shop before I head to the airport I am still in my bikini but when I get there it's about a 15 minute drive I figured my drive I could just dry off but when I get there I'm going to change try to somewhat put myself together a little bit so maybe I can take some more pics there but I'm really excited I am so sad to leave St. Pete I'm definitely gonna be coming back here with my husband because when he gets out of the military in two and a half years like I'm seeing it now we are moving here like I am obsessed with this place to find parking downtown in St. Pete. I am obsessed with this downtown area. It is literally so beautiful, all the buildings, the restaurants, the shops, but I feel so gross. My skin is so dry. I'm definitely gonna put on some moisturizer, but I'll do some sunscreen moisturizer. Oh, it is dripping everywhere. Oh, you're definitely getting on this plane very dirty and gross feeling but my flight is only like an hour and a half, so it should be good. But I'm gonna finish this up, get dressed, show you my final outfit, and then we'll go to the coffee shop. Yummy. 